Um, I don't know what to do. Give attention to me, attention to the kids. You just gotta like sit back and analyze like what are your distractions? It does appear that Kanye West may be headed back into a relationship with Kim Kardashian after the two separated earlier this year. Of course, this is creating an unreal frenzy on social media where users are talking about the possible matchup between the former couple. While we're so blessed, it's like to be able to get the mentors. Like that means the universe really wants this to happen. Like it's beautiful, it's like your dad. Despite multiple news outlets talking about the reasons behind the couple's falling out, Kanye West reportedly wants to get back with ex Kim. And it does appear that she might be interested as well. Yeah. From day one, Kanye has always been someone in my life who's always pushed me to do what I want to do, no matter what the rules are, no matter what people say. While recent events have made a patch-up look more and more likely, let's have a look at how things have been going as of late. Kim Kardashian and Kanye West had met for the first time in their lives in 2003, long before Kim was a reality TV star. However, it was not until 2008 that they officially became friends. By 2011, Kanye and Kim were dating and welcomed a daughter Northwest into the world just two years later in 2013. Since tying the knot in 2014, Kim and Kanye have welcomed another three children. Despite a number of considerably serious issues between the couple, the marriage survived for about seven years. It wasn't until the start of January 2021 that news broke out that Kim and Kanye were ending their marriage, and by February 19th, Kim Kardashian had officially filed for a divorce. The news did come as a shock for many, although a closer look showed that their marriage wasn't nearly perfect. The true beginning of the end of the Kardashian West marriage came when Kanye announced his campaign for the US presidency in July 2020. It was during a presidential rally where Kanye talked about discussing the option of aborting their first daughter, North. Although Kanye had made these statements to paint Kim in a good light, they ended up backfiring when Kanye was criticized by Kim and fans for outing those family secrets. However, that doesn't fully explain why Kim and Kanye had to part ways. For example, it appears that Kanye was just as tired of the marriage itself as Kim ever was. Before Kanye objected to it, Kim was also applying makeup on their five-year-old daughter's face. And some of the pictures are still there on her Instagram. According to Kim, it was Kanye West that stopped her from continuing to put makeup on their daughter. From Kim's statements, it was clear that Kanye did not appreciate that a daughter at that tender age was getting involved with makeup without any clear need for it. So the way Kanye and Kim both saw each other as parents also made a bit of difference. In fact, it was reported that Kanye was not the biggest fan of continuing to live in Los Angeles. He wanted to move to Wyoming in the outskirts of the city because he did not wish to expose his children to the fakeness in the world. However, come September, it appears that the two do have a chance of getting back together with each other. E! News reports that Kanye West now wants to reconcile with Kim, and she isn't against the idea entirely. A source by E! News went on to explain that Kardashian is very open to the idea of getting back together. Kim is not rushing the divorce, the insider revealed. She and Kanye are in a good place right now, and she is not on a rush timeline to push the divorce forward. West appears to want to fully reunite with Kardashian, though. The source described that Kanye has expressed that he wants her back, and Kim is open to it, but wants to focus first on rebuilding their foundation and friendship back stronger. On his album Donda, which was released at the end of August, Kanye West seems to talk about his past as well. Here, the past refers to Kanye's own actions after the couple just had their second child together. Through the lyrics, Drake insinuated that he still slept with other women after he fathered two children. The album Donda with the track Hurricane definitely unveiled some possible facts about the rapper's life. The most revealing lyrics perhaps are, Here I go acting too rich, here I go with a new chick, and I know what the truth is, still playing after two kids. It's a lot to digest when your life always moving. 
A source also told Page Six that the song is, in a way, his testimony of everything he did wrong and taking accountability for their marriage breakdown. If you look closer to the lyrics, he is referring to his infidelity during his marriage with Kim, even after two kids. However, Page Six was also told that Kanye's alleged infidelity was not exactly why Kardashian ultimately filed for divorce in February. Interestingly enough, Kim Kardashian also stunned everyone by wearing a wedding dress at Kanye West's latest album listening party. The idea was to recreate their wedding weeks after Kim claimed that she was still in love with him. It was also on Thursday night's Donda event that Kanye West took the fans by surprise by sharing the stage with his estranged wife, Kim Kardashian. Kim was dressed in a beautiful Balenciaga wedding dress and a face-concealing veil. This was moments before the pair were pictured holding hands outside the place. The images do seem to paint a picture of hope as far as Kanye and Kim getting back together is concerned. It appears that the former couple having four kids together might be helping to get them back together as well. The source told E! Further that Kardashian is also really happy to be on good terms with West again, especially for the sake of the kids who are really close to their dad. The couple currently has four children together, North 8, Saint 5, Chicago 3, and Psalm 2. E! News' update comes only a week after TMZ officially reported that Kardashian and West were reconsidering their divorce and trying to mend things between themselves. The outlet had written this back then. There actually is a chance they could get back together. They've been spending time together privately and working on building the foundation of their relationship. The two particularly have many areas of disagreement that have to be worked out, but want what's best for their kids. Whether Drake's involvement helps the chances of a patch-up is unclear, but it's definitely making Kanye uneasy and he has not hesitated to show it. After Drake repeatedly mentions having slept with Kiki, a nickname awarded to Kim Kardashian, Kanye publicly spoke up about feeling stabbed in the back. The alleged jealousy here can get quite obvious at times when Kanye is talking about these issues. It just might be that the jealousy that was ignited seeing Drake with his ex-wife also led him to want to reconcile with her. Kanye and Drake, who shared a marvelous business relationship in the early 2000s, now appear to be almost at each other's throats. Not only did the two also time their albums just under a week from each other, but Drake also shows no hesitation in roasting Kanye in his album Certified Loverboy. He also talks about the incident caused by Kanye, which led to his childhood home being vandalized. The back and forth between these stars had only gotten worse over the last few months when Kanye and Kim officially separated. Could jealousy from Drake actually result in Kanye and Kim getting back together? Only time can tell. The fans have been speculating and having fun around the current situation. While some would never want Kanye and Kim to get back together again, others seem to love it as the best possible option for the former couple. This user on Twitter had trouble believing the authenticity of the entire stunt in the first place. Here's what they wrote. I don't get this current stunt for Donda though. Divorcing Kim, but she's back at his listening concert in a wedding dress. So, back together, or just for show? Kim obviously loves the attention, but I'm wondering on Kanye's part. Would you agree or disagree? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and have a good day.